Good evening, everybody. I'm Phoebe Snow, and welcome back to Baldur's Gate Dark Alliance. Oh, that feels amazing to say. So, we have just cleared out the cellar of the rats, and we're going to go down into the sewers to go find Ethan, because um, he followed us down there. Um, I'm actually going to... Welcome, friend. If you're looking for a good blade or a sturdy shirt of chain mail, you've come to the right place. Our stock may be a bit low at the moment with the recent demand for weapons and armor, but a new shipment should be coming in soon. I love how he's just running his weapon store right out of the, uh, well, tavern. Well, I know the cause, friend, but the word is there's been some trouble between the thieves' guilds of late. No matter to me if the two groups kill each other. Never had much use for thieves myself. Now, what can I do for you? You can show me your wares. Our shop carries the finest dwarven weapons, brought here all the way from the Sunset Mountains. I always sell my uh, rejuvenation potions because I don't use any spells that require magic. So, I don't need them. Yeah, if you sell something that you have equipped, it'll give you a you error know, message first. Well, not an error message, but it'll be like, hey, you know, this is something that your you're using. You should probably not sell this. <laughs> Alright, so that should give us a little bit more firepower. I forget how to block. Hmm? Oh, okay, right trigger. Yeah, now that I have a now that I have a shield equipped, um I can block. Turn the music volume down a little bit. Oh, yeah. Music's a little loud. Ooh, I missed some gold. Interesting. Ooh, I missed more gold. Oh, there's the ring. Okay. Oh, I didn't pick up a recall potion, did I? Oh, this is where we stopped. Okay. So now we're heading towards the sewers. And now we run into these things. What did I just pick up? Oh, well, that doesn't do anything for me armor-wise, so... Oh, it was a ruby, not a ring. Okay. I thought I heard something wooden hit the ground. So yeah, these are kobolds. Found something. Found something. Little yappy. I did not mean to open the door. See how tanky the uh, tanky he is. Ooh, yeah. I need to stay away from that. Ooh, the battle axe. Nice. Yeah, I need to start being careful around here because, as you saw, there are barrels that can ignite. I don't want to get too terribly close to those. Ah, oh, found the recall potion. Cool. So that must be a random drop. Because that was in the room before the last save point when I did this earlier. I am trying to be super careful <laughs> with those barrels. Ooh, spiders. Yay. Oh god. Here I was saying how tanky he is. Um, getting my ass kicked by a couple of spiders. Yeah, see, the spiders killed this kobold here. And you see this room here. You're like, oh, how do you get to that? That's weird. There seems to be nothing there. Secret rooms. Oh, and there's a bow back there. 
which I'm not going to use. So I'm going to save it here. Recall back to the tavern. Many Sell my deals. shit. What are you looking for? Ooh. I didn't realize I picked up some boots. Um, longsword, arrows. Hmm. I'll hold on to the battle axe for an arrow. Mm. No, no. No, I won't. That's a lie. Our shop carries the finest dwarven weapons. Brought here all the way from the Sunset Mountains. Take some armor. Swords, axes, bows. We have everything you need right here. Yeah, I just sold my clothes, and now I am... Uh, almost in the buff. I don't have a helmet. I need to grab my. Uh, but, uh, I will need to grab one later. Oh, right. Recall. Hey, right, so now we're heading into the sewers. Let's go. What's this you've caught? A sewer rat? Don't hurt him. Lord Xantum will wish to speak to him, and he'll need to be in the best of health. Ah, excellent. I was expecting you. Did you receive the package from Lord Xantum? I... I did. And I have it with me. And you know where it is bound? He told me to take it to the crypts and place it within it's the... It's a void there on the left-hand side. Excellent. The entrance you seek lies on the level below past the sewer grates. Let no one see you enter the temple and do exactly as you have been instructed. Now be on your way. I will return for the prisoner later. Guard him well. Famous last words. Okay, so here we are in sewers. That's not a door. That is not a door or a gate or anything. That's just a hole in the wall. Looks like it's been just plowed through by like a bull or something. Save. I do a lot of saving in this game. Okay, so why are these rats taking two hits instead of one? Oh yeah, some of the kobolds throw javelins now. And they run when you try to get close. And they make the most annoying sound when they do it. The sad thing is you can never get a javelin in this game yourself. You don't get any thrown implements, you only get the bow. For any kind of range. Uh. For any kind of ranged weaponry, all you get is the bow, you don't get a spear or anything. Which sucks. I thought that was gold. That looks like gold on the ground right there. Stuck on the door frame. How bad of a aim are you guys? So the purple ones don't run. Got a leather helmet. Ooh, and a normal wooden shield, studded leather helmet. Okay. That increases my armor a little bit. The rats are so hard to see with all the water rippling around. But it's better than walking through the steam.
I don't like this part. So yeah, as I stated in the previous episode, I have a hard time staying out of battle. Is that literally what I have? Oh well. Sell it for funds. So yeah, this gets very difficult. Oh, I missed a... Yeah, okay. Yeah, did you see that javelin that just came out of almost nowhere? Yeah, we about to have fun with that. But first, get some more experience points going through this way. Take the back road. Get wrecked. I don't like fighting these things in the water because I can't see. Oh boy. I'm running. them out a little bit at a time. And in case that wasn't abundantly clear by how easy he was to kill, that is not the... that's called a bugbear. Um, that is not the bugbear that we saw in the opening cutscene of this level. Okay. That's a lot of spear, guys. Let's take this on. Actually, I'm going to save it first. Just whittle them down, like, two at a time. You can see my health is going up actually fairly quickly. Like, that's a, that is a noticeable increase. God. Okay, what did I just get? Um, ooh, padded gloves. Oh, I got two sets of padded gloves. Okay, that's fine by me. More stuff to sell. Oh, I did not check my health before I went back in. Yeah, you get that box. Get him. Pull the lever, Cromlock. Oh god. Actually blew through those easier than I thought. An elven wooden shield? Yeah. Cool. Jumping puzzles. I 
I think I need to start being careful with some of the chests at this point, because I think this is around where they introduce um, the explodey ones. <laughs> I actually walked straight into that. That was dumb. Get wrecked. This is getting rather long and tedious. Oh god. I pick up a Warhammer? Is that what that's Scared the hell out of us. <laughs> oh my god, come back here. That's some gold, I think. Nope, never mind. Thought it did. There we go, padded boots. No, I just no. When I said I scared myself earlier, I was leaning in to like, like concentrate more on the game, and I bumped my microphone, and it startled me. <laughs> Let's go back to the elf song. Oh well, why am I using the? Elven one, that's the same. If price are your chief concerns, then look no farther. You'll find my shop has excellent weapons at reasonable prices. I've got 19 healing potions. Oh, friend. I think the smell of the sewers has taken a liking to you. Well, oh, shut up. It's none of your business. Yeah, you can get some really nice uh, weaponry here. This one's always a fun one. The Flaming Longsword. And the Frost Bastard Sword. We have many fine deals. What are you looking for? Oh, shut up, I'm still looking. Ooh. I will take that. Our shop carries the finest dwarven weapons. Brought here all the way from the Sunset Mountains. Swords, axes, bows. We have everything you need right here. Okay, put on the mace and the shield. And then recall back to our... Oh, I never gave the bottle of wine to the, uh... They've got a bottle of wine for the, um, guy standing next to the shopkeeper. I keep forgetting to give him. Oh, that was almost bad. This gets a little dicey. Kill the intruders. Oh, 
Oh god. Hurry up, bad. Running. Oh god, no, 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 no. Oh. Please tell me I saved it after. No, I sure didn't. Alright, well, we can go back and give our friend the uh, bottle of wine while I'm thinking about it. What do you want? I got no coin to spare, so don't think your begging will make me part with a single copper. Oh, there's always been thieves in Baldur's Gate. This latest batch may be a bit more bloodthirsty than most, but they haven't crossed me yet. Still, I'd rather be able to part with my coins at the bar than keep them in my purse. I thought that's I thought that said this latest bitch might be a little more bloodthirsty. Ah, the bartender, Aleth, cut me off two nights ago. I keep coming back hoping she'll change her mind, but she hasn't come around yet. After two nights, nah, you gotta wait at least a week or so. And with the cellars locked, I can't slip down below to get a spare bottle to tide me over. But maybe you could. Now what makes him think that I could? Did he also overhear my conversation with Aerith? Aerith. Aleth, <laughs> when I got the key. If you could find some way to get that cellar door key from old Ethan, then head down to the cellars to get me a bottle, I'd make it worth your while. So that's the bottle of wine that we found earlier. Hey, it'll do me well enough. Thank you, friend. Uh, here, have a bottle from me. No idea what the thing does, but it smells awful and it doesn't seem to have the kick I was looking for. Yeah, you can't get drunk off a healing potion. Okay, now we're back where um, I was before I died. I've got all my equipment. I got the iron shield. I got my light mace. Take down this bugbear. I like that he wasn't hitting me at all. That was great. Pretty sure he also says cowards right before he says kill the intruders. So I don't know why they didn't subtitle that. But that's none of my business. Oh boy. Oh no 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 I think I just picked up a recall potion. Oh god, I wasn't paying attention to my health. Stop it. No, 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 no. Oh no, I'm stuck. Stuck on the stupidest shit. Oh, got him. Okay. What's sad is that helmet I picked up off the bugbear chieftain is isn't even as good as the one I've, I'm wearing right now. All right, let's loot the bodies. Okay, let's go down this way and oh look, it's our buddy Ethan. Dumb shit. I'm gonna loot all the stuff in here. I'm gonna take my sweet time coming and getting you out of that jail cell. Okay, never mind. Thank the gods you're here. Any longer and I'd be sitting in some kobold's belly. Well, after I gave you the cellar door key, I felt guilty about letting you head down here without help, so... I followed you down. No sooner do I get down here than I'm surrounded by those yapping cobalt devils and they haul me to this cell and lock me in. There's an entrance to the sewers from the street and I use that. I knew about it from my days when I was in the guild. 
the old guild, not the new one. Retired. Got life's behind me. Still, I've kept a bit of what I've learned, and I might help you now. I managed to pick this key off the chieftain you killed. I think it unlocks a gate deeper in the sewers. If you're still aiming to catch those thieves that robbed you, then you'll need it. While I was locked up here, I overheard some of the thieves from this new guild planning a mission. And that's what I heard. I don't know what that thief was carrying, but it can't have been good. If you want to stop whatever deviltry they've got planned, then you'll need to head deeper into the sewers and find that thief. Deviltry. I didn't realize that was a word. I thought it was just devilry you know, without the T. All right, then. I don't need to tell you to be careful. I'll meet up with you at the Elf Song Tavern later on. Come find me when you found that thief and what he was carrying. I'll try to dig up some of my old contacts and see if they can tell me anything about these thieves that could help you out. Much obliged, sir. If that doesn't hint to how Midwestern I am, I keep using the word obliged. So, that's the sewers cleared, or at least level one of the sewers. Like he said, we're going further into the sewers to go find that thief and whatever he was carrying. So, if you enjoyed this episode, please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one.